And this one's gone straight up in the air. All short of the mid-wicket fielder running in from the boundary. Oh, what a shot this is. Down the wicket, Gobar's wonderful foot movement, gets to the pitch of it, strokes it into the crowd. Evidence of what I've been talking about in relation to Gurbaz and his style of play. No nonsense attitude. That's just glorious use of the foot, feet even. Get to the pitch of the ball. And this time steps across, helps himself over the leg side. One bounce, four runs. Chennai Brave steam, so if they can take him out of the equation. It will mean light work for them later on. Absolutely. Clever batting as well. Fireworks indeed. Oh, and this is exactly where the fielder was. Shouldn't have moved him. Would have gone over his head anyway. Six more. One over gone. 18 without loss. Six more six. Uh, last three deliveries to end the over. Delhi Bulls trending with the bat. <laughs> Down the track, over the offside. Brilliant from Gabaz. He's not here to hang around or mess about. Fifth gear from the off. And the reason why he can't do this, he knows that uh, Munaf Patel doesn't have the pace like he used to possess in his prime. So he can't advance. Use that momentum into the ball to get it for a six, I reckon. That is a six, yeah. Puts it in the board. Alim Dar. This tournament so far. This one's over the leg side. This is an impressive one. Six more. And that's the over. Two gone. The balls are flying. 37 without loss. This one's over the offside. He's not got a hold of it, but it's going to run away for four nonetheless. Gurbaz races to 33 from just nine balls. Two fours, four sixes. Because of that solid base, he is uh, in a good position to swing despite it being a slow ball and gets enough. Oh, flick to the leg side, wonderful batsmanship. It was a slower ball, adjusted well, helped it on its way. 45 was inside the circle. I tell you what, the most impressive thing about this shot was the awareness as to where the fielders are. He knew there was a short, fine leg, he didn't have to use power. It was all about getting the bat angle right to find the gap. 46 on the board already. 35 required now from just 45 balls. Oh, and this one smashed to the leg side. Man, get him round. Is he going to cut it off? No. And that's the 50 up for the Delhi Bulls. 50 for none from 2.4. Dream 11 game changing 50. This for Delhi. We were keen to find out this, uh, this opening pair would have produced the goods for the Bulls, well guess what, they have so far. 50 and just 2.4 overs. It's going a long way to winning this game already for Delhi. Oh, this one's gone high, this one's gone handsome, it's gone all the way, another incredible maximum for Gubaz. Oh. Gubaz. Making the Zaid Stadium his own kingdom. In complete control, doing as he pleases. Well, he's taken 12 balls to get to 47 so far. And you know what that means, ladies and gentlemen. The first is 50 this year. He's in 15 balls by Phil Salt. Is he going to pinch that from Salt? 
That was there for it as well, but flies through to the keeper. Three gone, 56 without loss. Oh, and there you go. He doesn't mess around either. This one's gone so high. It's gone for six. That's the fastest 50 of the Abu Dhabi T10 season. 14 deliveries. And that's a huge, huge six to bring it up. And he's pumped. Whacked away for six. Getting to that record of the fastest half century in fine style. The most impressive innings uh, from the young man from Afghanistan. And his captain loves it.